What's good YouTube, it's your boy Mathematica back again with another video and today's video is gonna be about Black Youngster, that's right. Now I know y'all seen the video with Black Youngster signed his first artist to his label, label Heavy Count. This man dumped 250,000 to 300,000 on the hood of a car, you know what I'm saying? Big ups to Youngster, you know, congrats to the dude he signed. You know, that's good, that man, you know, giving out opportunity trying to help you know people get up off the streets but i gotta speak on this you know what i'm saying i just think that wasn't a smart move i'm not saying that black youngster a stupid man you know i ain't saying uh, you know he you know he acts stupid but this man he, he he gotta be smart to walk around with money and you know to make money can't no stupid motherfucker make money you know what i'm saying but you know I just think a real businessman wouldn't do business like that. To the people that's doing business that involves money, this is the wrong way to do business. And you know, I advise you if somebody, you know, want to sign you to a to a, a a deal like that, don't even take it. You know what I'm saying? You know, I just think that could have been done one on one in a car or somewhere where it don't involve the whole damn neighborhood you know me and my manager and lawyer him his manager and lawyer you know what i'm saying i just think youngster made this man a target even more it was a stupid move and a bad idea you never know what type of enemies this man got or baby mamas he got ready to put this man on child support you know what I'm saying? Like, anything could happen to this man. He can get robbed. His fam could get took it for ransom. Anything. Now, the whole neighborhood watched this man sign that deal. Got his stacks and rolled off in his new car. This is not the way to do business. I just think Youngster could have made it more comfortable for this man. You know what I'm saying? Like, bring some strippers in. Have a few shots. Smoke a blunt or whatever. You know, whatever these men do to enjoy themselves or however they celebrate, you know what I'm saying? The man needed to be in an office where he could sit back, relax, read that contract, then sign it. You know what I'm saying? It looked like this man didn't get a chance to read it, read it or nothing. You know what I'm saying? He just signed it. You never know what the contract said or what kind of bullshit it had in it. Like youngster could own this man for the next 10, 20 years, you know, Plus, my, he, plus, he, plus this, this man might be a walking target. You know, this is not the way to do business, people. You, you, you never know what'll happen. Shit, you, you, you niggas keep signing to these motherfuckers, man. Y'all gonna, y'all niggas gonna learn to stop signing with these dope heads. Ain't no way I'm gonna sign to a nigga that play with his nose, pop pills, sip lean, and walk around flossing, playing with a hundred thousand in cash, acting ignorant and shit in every damn video. You know, it's a lot of coolness, buffoon shit going on. Ain't no way I would have signed to this man. You know what I'm saying? But shout out to the dude that signed. You know, I'll still get a team of lawyers to look over that contract. I know deep down inside, that young man was like, damn, why did this dumbass nigga do it this way? You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. But you know, good luck to you, fam. But anyway, I'm signing out. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.